before we before we get started, um, Nick here, um, you've got you know if I'm looking at my my notes here that I've got from from your background, Nick, you've got a tremendous background across a few different industries. So you've been in manufacturing tech and then into digital marketing. Um, but what I really like is is that you kind of echoed some of what I've just said there in terms of you know you want to use your position um, at, at Pipeline Forty Four to educate and support business owners in, in getting some of the right marketing done, not, not some of the things that are being peddled out there that, that maybe work or don't work. So in your own words, I guess, if you could uh, give us a bit of a background, how you got where you are. Yeah, sure. So uh, for all those uh, marketeers out there, I, I actually started in sales and I consider myself a sales, salesman, not, not typically a marketeer. Uh, but when I was a kid, I was uh, a bit of a waste of space and uh, left school didn't go to university and I thought, you know, I need to get a job. I chucked a CV out online and I got given this opportunity. Who knows why? Um, and I ended up in channel sales and it was, it was, I mean, long story short, but it was the best thing that could have happened to me, to be honest. So I spent the first eight years of my working life traveling around the world, managing distributors, selling manufacturing, uh, manufactured product um, in all sorts of different places. Uh, predominantly Middle East and, and North Africa and the States and various others. Um, but yeah, that was, that was kind of my start. And then, and then after that, I kind of learned there's a very clever sales guy who, who does all sorts of things around on the internet um, at the moment, a guy called Marcus Kauke. And he once said to me that salespeople make the best CEOs. And I think he's uh, absolutely right. <laughs> Not that that sort of uh, plays into my current position specifically, but uh, you get to learn business from all sorts of different angles when you're managing channel partners and when you're traveling and you're doing deals, uh, including finance and obviously sales and all facets of, of business. But, but marketing is obviously going to be a big one of them. Now, I don't make a huge distinction between sales and marketing. I think they're just two different parts of the same process. I believe your previous guest had something similar to say about that, that subject. But um, yeah, so I went into business for myself just after that. and. I don't know how many companies later, some, some failed, some succeeded. I find myself now back in a position where I'm investing in and supporting businesses that kind of are fun, that float my boat, that are interesting, a great wide range of things.